Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is your weekly tarot reading for the sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon and Rising from the 20th to the 26th of July 2020. I hope you are Sagittarius. So let's get straight into your reading. This is the black and gold tarot deck. What do we have for Sagittarius please? Okay, we've got the Knight of Cups, card of Pisces. Not limited to Pisces, can be just the energy. Okay. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Angel Spirits Guides. Message for Sagittarius. This is the Sacred Power Oracle Cards or Reading Cards. Message for our lovely Sagittarians, please. Angel Assistance. Hmm. Okay, what is the message for Sagittarius Angels? 20th to the 26th of July, 2020. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Thank you. We have no. <laughs> Let's get more information. <laughs> we have take action. Interesting, Sagittarius. Let's just go with it because, you know, sometimes these cards make sense when uh, we put everything on the table. Okay. So I pull four cards, Sagittarius. The first card is you. Second card is your challenge. Third card is advice from spirit. Fourth card is your outcome. And then we will pull clarifiers to go deeper into the message. It won't resonate for everybody, so just take what resonates with you. Okay. Star, card of Aquarius, this is you. King of Swords is your challenge. Six of Swords is advice from spirit. And we have the Tower as your outcome. Okay, let's clarify the cards to go deeper into the message, please. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Angels, Spirits, Guides. Message for Sagittarius. Oh, too many. Too many. Too many. Oh, there's a lot of energy in the card for the fire signs. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Angel, Spirits, Guides. Starting with the star. Thank you. The moon. Justice is clarifying the king of swords. We have the devil clarifying the six of swords. And we have the, wow, Sagittarius, wow. We have the ten of swords clarifying the tower. You know, we've got the lovers bottom of the deck. Okay, Sagittarius. The Knight of Cups is, you know, it's angel assistance. So it's almost kind of like in matters of the heart, you're being given help, assistance from the universe. I mean, there's so much universal energy here as well. Um, towards a new path, I feel, for some of you. So this is absolutely about trusting your intuition because it's almost kind of like, you know, it's the, it's the Pisces card, 12th house, house of spirit, house of magic. I feel this is you, Sagittarius, this is you being guided forward by spirit, angels, guides. The message is trust your intuition, do what feels right. This is about opening up to change, opening up to moving forward in a situation, following your heart and... Um, yeah, I might be moving on in terms of matters of the heart, relationships, for some of you. Because the message, certainly with the Knight of Cups, is to take action. And I feel, you know, the Knight of Cups is in search of love, they're in search of happiness, they're in search of what brings them joy, very much in touch with their emotions and feelings. But, you know, the Knights in Tarot are also their, their rescuers. Um, and it's almost kind of like 
with the help of angel spirits guides you are your own rescuer this is how you, how you can bring positive change in matters of the heart by your own actions now because the message is absolutely now is the time to take action in terms of matters of the heart here Sagittarius now the no is interesting because I've got the devil there's a lot of um, the devil, the tower energy it's almost kind of like if you're asking yourself could I have done something different is is there something that I, I could have done to stop this um, can I reconnect to this person in this instance I would say no you know we have a lot of liberating energies in this reading the message is absolutely no from the universe now that's not for everybody but it would be relevant for people who this reading resonates for so for those of you who are thinking did I do the wrong thing are you blaming yourself are you feeling guilty about a situation are you feeling um, uh, you were responsible or you could have done something differently you know the answer is a resounding no now is the time to take action towards a new path and allow yourself to move on I'm feeling that really strongly Sagittarius so that's what I'm kind of getting from those energies because it's interesting the star comes after the tower in the major arcana so you in your situation now the star represents new hope new dreams a new direction for some of you liberate yourself from what's gone you know the water pours onto the earth to fertilize the land there's new growth here and it's almost kind of like what how the tower may have stripped um you bear in terms of attachments um what you thought was solid secure the the truth the the nakedness of this being is is you understanding what you're made of it's a sense of new renewal it's a sense of blessings being poured into your truth into your true light from the universe now you standing in your true light when the star appears it's a wonderful wonderful energy of divine wish fulfillment uh, you are being blessed you are being guided on this journey and the moon energy is absolutely clarifying that and it's very much again a card of Pisces again the Knight of Cups is a card of Pisces as well so straight off the bat I'm getting the Pisces energy again you are absolutely being guided forward here you are being guided forward by spirit angels guides it's a beautiful beautiful energy so trust your intuition even though you don't see the path forward clearly here Sagittarius the universe does the universe sees the path that you need to follow now so this is about going within there are hidden blessings being given to you everything will make sense if you trust your instincts your inner knowing your intuition here and liberate from what's gone there could have been some truth that came to light Sagittarius and that was your challenge some some truth that was revealed now the King of Swords the Justice card this can be to do with legal situ situations the law legal situations government institutions and um, sometimes appears when there's difficulties in, in marriage and um, can be in divorce can be in separation can be division of assets I mean you know you kind of get what I'm saying could be to do with that it's not l solely linked to that the justice card is also a card of Libra where you might be trying to find balance in your situation get your balance back um, in your life now and the king of swords is somebody who is a visionary somebody who is very much the star energy it is finding that new direction getting your mind around a situation getting clarity of the mind seeing the truth of the situation for what it is and allowing yourself to move forward towards a new vision a new goal um, this is somebody who sees the big picture and I feel for some of you there's a message of now is the time to get perspective see the big picture make a plan it's almost kind of like make plans have a strategy on how you move forward this can be about somebody who is strategizes making plans towards a vision a goal um, and it's almost kind of like you need to find balance here I also feel here with the justice card this can be about a cause and effect reap what you sow energy as well what you put into something is what you get back and it's almost kind of like you're being told to put your energy 
in the right direction towards this new vision and liberate from what's gone you know it's these energies are very liberating it's two cards of Aquarius we have Libra and Pisces Capricorn uh, Gemini so those could be people in your life or part of your sign too this and what are you liberating from Sagittarius well you're liberating from a difficult situation and um, this can be the two lovers here which is the lovers here so for some of you there could have been a love triangle yeah there could have been a love triangle here where either you were choosing between do two different people or somebody else out of your other half could have been choo could have been you know be choosing between two other people and that could be one of the situations here for some of you I kind of feel that this devil situation is also to do with I mean this can be to do with unhealthy relationships something that has caused you great instability in a relationship now that could be you know I kind of feel this is more love romance but it could equally be to do with um relationships at work relationships with family relationships with friendships as well uh or you know work situations whatever this is you are detaching from it it's almost kind of like whatever this instability has caused you you are detaching from the troubled waters of what this devil represented and moving towards something better plain sailing again this is aquarian energy we have two aquarian this is the new vision, the new goal, the new dream here. Star is dare to dream. Um, and I feel for some of you, you are beginning to get perspective in terms of what you want now. It is a challenge, but I do think things are becoming clear in the direction that you need to take. Very, le very much led by your intuition as well. Um, towards a new path. And the six is very much about getting harmony. Um, back in your life but also in your mind in your mental outlook as well something has really played with your mind here your emotions your mind so the turn of swords Sagittarius with the tower this is betrayal you know this is this is this is betrayal. Um, Ten of Swords is deep wounds, deep hurts. Um, truths that may have come to light that cut so deeply it's floored you for a period of time and it's all down to this tower energy. Something that you thought was stable and secure, this can be in terms of the home, can be the home. Um, this can be in terms of the relationship that you thought was solid, stable, secure. Um, in whatever context I feel for some of you certainly with this ten of swords the ten represents an ending here and um, but it is a very difficult energy to get through some kind of like revelation truth coming to light and um, yeah that brings deep change to a situation um, now this is the way the universe realigns you towards a new path Sagittarius as well and for some of you you're being shown love by the universe in this tower energy that though something is destroyed in the tower it is realigning you to where you need to be the new path and I feel that's why the knight of cups house of spirit angels you know it's a beautiful energy of you're being realigned bringing positive change to your situation trust your instinct because this is you you're being realigned towards a new path if you're thinking could you change anything to do with the situation this is absolutely a confirmation that this was always going to be beyond your control that in whichever way this tower was always going to happen so it is about now is the time to allow endings to happen to this situation and I feel that's what that no is it's not a time to go back it's not a time to to overthink a situation either swords energy again linked with the mind it is a time to very much focus on moving forward king of swords towards a new goal a new vision because this sun is rising in the distance this is the sun in gemini card and it's almost kind of like whatever hurts there have been 
the sun is very much a healing restorative energy it's also an enlightening energy of allow endings to happen in order to move on to a new day a new dawn here you know because there is a new day a new dawn rising um, and pushing away the dark cloud so whatever this darkness has been I feel for some of you now is the time for you to move forward and we have the lovers here Sagittarius now like I said there could have been third party situations I see this as you coming back to who you are um, this can be a reconnection to self we have Archangel Raphael here God's healer I feel this is very much you healing from what's gone and absolutely finding the path forward to bring positive change in your life now by really going within trusting your intuition to move forward in a situation it might also be that you have a choice decision to make in terms of this love maybe final decision choice that you 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 might have been putting off but it might well be to do with some legal situation implementation to do with could be separation divorce you know I mean you kind of get what I'm saying here as well Sagittarius it may well be for some of you you might well be getting clarity on that finally um, but yeah I love this energy because it's an energy you see when you reconnect to your higher self as well there is no obstacle that you can't overcome so yeah it's the beautiful beautiful energy so I'm going to get some additional advice here, Sagittarius. I'm really feeling this energy. Now, it can also be new love. Some of you could be opening up to new love as well. So let's get some advice. Because the Knight of Cups can be an offer of new love. Um, yeah. What else do we have, please, Angel Spirits Guides? Yeah. So the advice is Seven of Pentacles energy. Evaluate where you focus your time and energy now. Don't focus your time and energy on what you're not going to get reward from. It is about focusing your time and energy on what is going to bring you value, solidity, security, um, growth into your life rather than wasting your time on something though where you're not going to get anything back and again I feel you're getting clarity on that here some of you may well be evaluating as well to make those choices decisions that you need to make in terms of connecting to justice law legal proceedings maybe it's too many there sorry so I just want to get one more please any other message for Sagittarius thank you okay <laughs> yeah there could be new love on the cards here and um, there might well be new love coming your way Sagittarius um, certainly Knight of Cups King of Cups can suggest that we've got the Knight of Cups again but this is a message that you are absolutely being guided by the universe God the Divine towards bringing change to your situation now go within because you're being given hidden blessings here and again that's reinforced by the moon energy and the king of cups again this can be an offer or an opportunity in love but it is also about rising above situations that have been emotional and mastering your emotions you know the king of cups is somebody who masters their emotions and it's almost kind of like in order to move forward master your emotions to bring positive change to your situation you know bottom of this deck we have the six of six of wands we have the victory card putting a difficult time a difficult challenge behind you and moving forward in your power opening your heart to new experiences so for some of you there could be new love on the cards too it's a beautiful beautiful energy here because the six the six of in tarot um, is at the heart center of the tree of life something that the tower was structured around and this is where your heart is opening it's opening again it's Leo energy you have mastered the challenges of the heart and now you're open to receive something new so it's a lovely lovely energy Sagittarius Wow gosh that was it's been a difficult a difficult journey though I have to say a difficult journey but it is going to get better okay what do we have as a final message for Sagittarius please thank you 
we have wail tenderness show compassion and forgive what needs to be forgiven forgiveness is how you release it's not always for somebody else's benefit it's for you how you make peace with what's gone so you can bring positive change to your situation and last message please for Sagittarius thank you okay let's choose yeah I like this energy grounding elephant ground your energies and emotions deep into the earth and one more I will pull we have sea turtle conservation make conscious choices and I feel that's very much to do with the lovers energy as well for some of you now's the time to make choices connect to who you are and understand how you want to make forward to move forward towards this vision I hope you enjoyed the reading Sagittarius if you did please do like share and subscribe I hope it's a wonderful week for you and I will see you next time thank you